Welcome back. My name is Dr. Zia. Uh, in, uh, this is my lecture series on strategic planning and management. In this lecture, I'm going to talk about the sixth strategy analysis tool that is called early warning systems. The purpose of strategic early warning system is to de detect or predict strategically important events as early as possible. Remember, they can often use use to identify the first scene of attack from competitors or to assess the likelihood of a given scenario becoming reality. There are, uh, there are seven components of an early warning system, which include number one, market definition, number two, open systems, number three, filtration, Number four, uh, uh, predictive intelligence. Number fifth, communicating intelligence. Number sixth, contingency planning. And number seven, and the final one is cycli uh, cyclic approach. So let's talk about the first one. Let's go in detail one by one. Number one, market definition. What is market definition? It is a clear definition of the scope of the arena to be uh, scrutinized. What, is, what does it mean? For example, uh, uh, is the arena a particular geographical region, brand or market? You need to focus on that, whether it is uh, of some geographical region or it's of some brand or it solves some market. The second uh, component is called open systems. It is an, an ability to capture a wide range of information on relevant competitors. The third one is called filtration. Filtration means information that has been collected on the arena needs to be filtered according to significance. Experts uh, interpretation is uh, required in order to identify particular events and significant uh, 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 i mean those events which signify the strategic move or shifts so the fourth one is predictive intelligence predictive intelligence is using knowledge of the forces driving a competitor to predict which direction they are likely to take one technique is to build likely scenarios and activity seek the signals that confirm the scenario. The predictions need to be assessed for their probability of occurring and potential impact. The fifth one or fifth component is communicating intelligence. It is ensuring that the right people in an organization receive a regular briefing on key signals. The sixth component is contingency planning. Events that have a high potential impact or probability of occurring may merit contingency plan. For example, a change of strategy or mitigation actions, etc. etc. The seventh one is a cyclic process. This component includes that it is the pro uh, says that it is the process of scrutinizing information for new uh, warning signals which should never stop while the emphasis is on emerging threats and opportunities the process should be flexible enough uh, to um, i mean tackle unexpected shorter term developments too so uh, in this lecture, we covered seven key components of early warning system, including market definition, open system, filtration, uh, predictive intelligence, communicating intelligence, contingency planning, and cyclic process. My name is Dr. Zia. I thank you very much.